and fans are gathering tonight to pay tribute to the Soul Train creator, Don Cornelius, who died in an apparent suicide yesterday. LAPD investigators say Cornelius was suffering from health problems and financial issues. California's Prop 8 trial will not be released to the public. A federal appeals court ruled that they must remain sealed. Well, a new war of words has broken out between Republicans and Democrats after Donald Trump endorsed frontrunner Mitt Romney for the GOP presidential nomination today. KTLA's Glenn Walker has more now from our election center. And you're right, Micah. Tonight's special report, Hunger Pains, is sure to strike a chord with anyone who has struggled to lose 5, 10, or even 100 pounds or more. And I sit down with one Orange County mother whose quest to lose weight could have cost her her life behind that, that you need to be treated first for uh, those reasons why you overeat. Mm -hmm. Micah? Uproar affecting millions of women, especially those right here in Southern California. The Susan G. Komen for the Cure Foundation is cutting funding to Planned Parenthood, and some within the organization are asking that it reverse the decision. Brandy Hit, live outside Planned Investigators are searching for a gunman who fired into a home in Santa Fe Springs, hitting a 12-year-old boy as he slept. The of the lap band will stop selling its products to clinics affiliated with the 1-800-GET-THING marketing company. Irvine, should sugar be regulated like alcohol or tobacco? Researchers at UC San Francisco say yes. In fact.